Hey everyone, it's Jenny. I am back with another project share. This is um, a Jennifer McGuire tutorial that um, I followed and it's basically, I think she calls it water painting. I will try to link the, um, the video that I watched um, below, but it's super easy. All you have to do is um, emboss heat emboss your image and then um, go over it with like your applicator, your ink applicator and use um, some kind of like either distress or distress oxides. I think she says distress oxides work better. So um, you cover it with a lot of ink <clears throat> and then you just get your water brush and you lift the ink off. So you wet it down with water and then you get like a paper towel and then you um, you absorb all that water and then it starts to change color. So this is, um, I, I made six cards using two different, or three different techniques um, involving that same, uh, three different types using the same technique. <laughs> anyway, so this is, um, this is an Altenew, older Altenew set, and this is a My Favorite Things um, sentiment, and I just used the Distress Oxides, and I think it was like pinks and oranges and yellows. And then this one I just lifted the ink off. So it just turns it a little bit lighter shade than what you would um, normally get. And then this one, what I did was, it's hard to see, but I added Winkostella um, onto the image where I did lift the um, color off. And I really like how that came out. This is also an alternate set, that's an older one as well. This is a pretty pink posh flower set. And I like the fact that you can overlap the flowers. I think that that looks really neat. Um, and then this one, what I did was after I lifted the ink off, then I got another color. So I grabbed the pink and then I added that. And then so you can add different colors um, to your image. And then um, I taught a class on it. So this is what the class sample. Well, this is the first ones are the ones I made for the samples, but then um, these new sets came in before the class, so I decided to use those. Didn't do a good job in embossing this for some reason, but you can kind of get the point. This is an Altenew set. Um, and then what happened here was I my ink wasn't completely dry before I added the embossing. So what you could do to avoid that is you could just stamp and emboss all at the same time with the flowers. Um, or you need to wait until this is totally dry, the background is totally dry, otherwise you're going to get all these. See how it's not that neat looking, it looks kind of messy. But anyway, this is that same one where you add the color afterwards, like this one. So I did like a um, seedless preserves. I tried to blend it with a different color, but it mostly turned out the purple. And then um, I added the, I think it's broken china or peacock feathers or something to it. And then this one is that with the um, shimmer. This one you can see better. really like this new stamp set by Altenew. I love that. That came out nice. And then I love this leaf set. So this is just the first version where you just lift off the water. Anyway, um, I just wanted to share that. I'm going to give these back to the store so that she has samples of um, the different stamps. But anyway, I hope you guys like my project here. I do have a um, small haul that I can share, so I'll try to film that next. Thanks, bye.